Good morning, everybody. We are at yet again another new pond. Huge, huge shout out to Hunter from Fishbrain. He's the one who gave me this spot. So don't go asking me where it is. I'm not going to tell you. And uh, we're going to try and get an underwater video. The water is very, very clear. So we're going to get the camera rod in first to see if we can catch some of these fish, man. This is going to be mainly how catfish react to punch bait underwater. Let's get a camera rigged up. All right. The first one, I think we're going to try. I don't know. I've been having a lot of luck on the Echo Gizzard lately. So I think we'll try that one first. We got the striker. This is the Echo Gizzard flavor. Like I said, I've been having a lot of luck on this one lately. Rolling. We're rolling. Let's see how long it takes. See if we can find these fish. Always love fishing those new spots, especially when you know the water is clear, guys. We're just gonna go right there. Got him that time. Ooh. He's pulling. He is pulling. Let's go. First one of the day. Not on the camera rod. You guys already know. Oh my God, there goes the camera rod. Speak of the devil. Oh, jeez. He's definitely pulling hard though. Let's go. Shout out to all you guys that fish the same ponds every time you fish. Go find some new ones. Jeez, here we go. Here we go. Let's see how big. Man, they are fighters in here. It's about average, but he's just freaking pulling hard. Man, okay. Let's land him if we can. Yes, there we go. Look at that healthy, fat channel cat, man. That is such a healthy fish for a pond like this. He is stocky on the Bravo garlic. Ugh. All right, guys, here we go underwater. Now, the sun was not out yet, so it's still kind of dark in these first few clips, but you can see a little catfish there swimming to the left. And this one kind of just sneak attacks us. Boom! Slams it. That was on the camera. We just got down there. Oh, literally like seconds ago. He's pulling drag. Let's go. <laughs> Jeez. Oh man. All these fish are just juiced up. They must have a pretty healthy supply of food in here, but just healthy. Oh. Wow, look at that healthy channel cat. And that was on the camera rod. So hopefully you guys are seeing what's going on down there. Really healthy fish. I'm gonna get him back in the water. See if we can get another one, man. This guy go. Boom, straight back to the abyss. That one almost pulled the freaking backpack in the water. We got a nice one, I think. Ooh. I only have 20 pound leader on here, guys. Oh my goodness. This is crazy. Okay, I'm gonna stand right here so I'm not in the way of my other rods, but jeez, this guy, he's just pulling. Definitely a heavy fish. Heavy fish. Oh, man. I haven't been able to budge him from the middle of the pond. Oh, my gosh. I can't even get him right here. I don't think he's foul hooked. Whatever this is. This is insane. Here we go. I'm just gonna take my time, guys. It's the best thing to do with these fish. Don't want them to break your line because they can easily do that. Oh, 
Should have brought my net. Nice long channel cat. This is gonna be interesting. Oh, he's barely, barely on there, man. Oh yeah, we got him. We got him. Look at that, barely in the corner. Jeez, what a brute. Freaking brute. Fat old head on that fish. Really healthy, look at that belly. He's just really uh, long, so he's got a lot of pulling power with that tail, but uh, let's get him back in the water. Thank you for the fight, guy. There he goes. Wow. Well, we're gonna check the camera out because we haven't gotten bit there in a while. All right, back underwater. I was reeling in and I saw this little, I believe it's a goldfish. I thought it was a koi originally, but I believe this is a goldfish here. And he's just feeding. You'll actually see a bunch more of these uh, in the video. Anyways, we're back under. The sun is still not out yet, but I promise when it comes up, you can see a lot more. Here's a little school of bluegill just above. Here we'll get our first catfish. Nice belly on that one. We're gonna replay it here for you guys to see. Look at the belly. That is a nice size fish right there. We'll get another one coming from the left. A little hesitant. And then unfortunately on the rest of this cast, we were just littered with small bluegill. Um, so after this, we actually ended up moving to kind of another side of the pond just because we weren't really getting any more catfish bites in this spot. Uh, so yeah, we packed up, cast it in. Uh, so we are going right back down there. You'll see that big old glob of punch bait right there. <laughs> Here the sun was starting to come out, so you can definitely see a lot more going on here. Here we'll have one to the right. You kind of see it getting cloudy, and then you'll see him pop his head in right here, and then boom, picks it up. And we're gonna replay this just because it was a little slower. I'll kind of point an arrow right here. See him, he shies away, then comes back, sucks it up, and boom, fish on. Well, the camera rod, baby. We were just casting that other one, and this one just... Oh, he's going. He's going. This one just takes off. I'm trying to keep him away here. Oh, yeah, another nice one. Good fish. Whoa. Hopefully that came out really well on the camera. I'm really hoping. Oh, he's just digging on me. Jeez. Another reason is I'm keeping it light is I don't want to pull the hook out of their mouth because sometimes you don't have them very well. And like this one, I don't have well at all. Come on, man. What's up? Sorry, guys. I'm focusing. I'm not really being as enthusiastic as I should be, but wow. I really should have brought the net. We got him. <laughs> we got him. But wow, look at that healthy, fat, brew channel cat, man. All on the striker. This one is nice. Not as big as the first, but man, look at the belly on that fish. I really hope the footage is coming out, guys. Let's let him go as always. There he is. <laughs> These fish are just tanks and they're all mad. Look at that. Well, we're doing it, baby. All right, not wasting any more time. We're back down in the same spot. Here, the bait is to the left. Boom, you see that fish just pick it up. No hesitation on this one. You see him taste and boom, sucks it all the way in. Unfortunately, after that, he just kind of pops off. We did not hook that one. 
Uh, but here we got a little bluegill. Of course, we always got to see the panfish. They are always down there here to the right. Kind of gets spooked by something there. I couldn't really tell what spooked him, but he definitely did not like either the camera or the rig or something. Here we get some more goldfish. More goldfish. People just letting their pets go, I'm assuming. Is quite common. Here we'll have another one. Just kind of deny it. Comes up to it. Uh, not too interested. This is interesting to see because on top of the water, uh, it seemed like we were getting fairly consistent bites. So you don't really know how many are actually swerving it. There's another. There's another. Comes back. Swerves it again. So maybe the bite wasn't as good as I thought it was on top of the water. Get another one, comes straight up and just swims away. Getting bit. Nope. Got him. Got him. Didn't even have a chance to change the battery. Okay. These fish are angry. Angry guys. So angry. What a pond. Look at these fish, man. They think they're sharks or something. <laughs> insane look at this this is a catfish not a carp but like I said I'm taking it easy on them because I don't want to pull these hooks out I've already done it a few times I wonder if I could change the battery mid fight I'm going to go for it I need to loosen this though These fish are so powerful. I think out of all the ones I've fought so far, this pond might be the hardest fighting fish. Here we go. Here we go. Haven't seen him. He's coming up. Oh, I see him. Another nice fish. <laughs> I guess this gives me time to uh, change that battery. Another healthy, and I mean healthy, channel cat. Look at the belly. It's just insane, man. There's so many in here. Let's let them go. All on the striker bait. I know Arizona is a really big catch and keep type place, but if you guys want to keep these ponds alive, man, it's nice to let some go. I see people, you know, fishing the same pond every day, just trying to catch a limit, but we got to preserve some of these fish. He's out of there. Oh, what a successful day so far, guys. Super successful day. All right, here you'll see the bait right to the left. Get another cold fish passing by. And then here, for a split second, you'll see him come in and grab it. Kind of hard to see, but uh, he lets go. Same thing from the right. Smells it, but is not too interested. Here we get a koi, or not a koi, a goldfish and a catfish at the same time. <laughs> they both shy away. We end up rebaiting that and getting it back in there. And as I'm tightening the line, I actually switched flavors. This is the alpha blood. You'll see that one already on it. And boom. No hesitation on that one as compared to the others. Picks it up, takes it, and unfortunately does not get the hook on that one.
I'm feeling these bites on top of the water, guys. I am feeling them, but it's just little pecks. This one kind of searching, but not too sold on it. This is interesting to see. This punch bait, I figured they just picked it up and went with it, but as you can see, it's not uh, not as cut and dry as that. That's how we got it. Kind of hoping he didn't. He is a slob. <sighs> wow, we got him. Look at that fish. That is a healthy Arizona catfish right there. But wow, that is our second brute of the day really healthy fish we're gonna let them go we're gonna keep this pond alive guys keep it alive let the big ones go sometimes that's what you got to do to preserve these ponds but there he is <laughs> i don't even want to put him back in the water i just want to admire him this one here we go we got the bait back down there you'll see this one come in from the back kind of shies away but he definitely likes something he smelled because he came back again and then he kind of stays around kind of circling it a little bit takes a few bites you can still see him back there kind of circling around trying to make up his mind searching searching <laughs> And this clip is non-stop. I haven't edited this at all. So he's just in the area. To the right. To the right. And finally, we get him to commit. Jeez. today but I am not complaining there we go but these fish are juiced up this was probably gonna be the last one of the day I hope the footage came out all right thank you guys so much for watching <laughs>